Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for coming. If you are new here, go ahead and join the family lamb. So the first order of business is if you guys would do me the honor of subscribing to my channel, because it will be an honor to me to have you join. And go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you like the video. And um, go ahead and hit that notification bell so you can be made aware every time I upload a video. I will be most, most, most welcomed and appreciated if you do that for me. Thank you so much for all that do. So, I'm back today with book number three for the Reunited series. And um, the name of book number three is Truth or Consequences. And the two main characters in this book, which is written by Sharon C. Cooper, in case you have not watched the first two um, books reviews for this series, Sharon C. Cooper is the author. Great author, a great writer, love all her stuff. And so this is book number three. So on book number three, again, which is named Truth or Consequences, we have Natasha Lockham and Malik Lewis. So, um, Natasha is the chief, um, what you call it, a chief, she's a, um, she's a hospital chief of staff at the hospital she worked at. She was a surgeon, and now she's the, um, chief of staff of the hospital. And Malik, who's a ex-seal, now runs his own security company. And um, if you go ahead and read the first two books or even listen to my review, you will know that you learn that in um, book one and two. You will hear about that. So, anywho, this is Malik's story and Natasha's story. So, in this story, um, in book two... At the end, Malik and Natasha is in Vegas, and when the t they're left alone in Vegas, they end up having a one-night stand together. And number one, this is a first for Natasha, who was married, now divorced. And for Malik, this is not a first. He's a serial one-night stander. However, this is the first time that he can't stop thinking about said first um, said one night stand with said woman. <laughs> so basically Malik going through his changes, Natasha's going through her changes, and it ends up at a point where she suspects something bad is going at on at the hospital that she's at and a doctor might be mixed up in it and her life end up being threatened in the process and Malik end up happening to um, basically watch over her, secure her, be her protector and it's really good um, to watch them go through the changes they go through is crazy and the crazy part is the guy that's possibly after her is just as good as Malik is as far as skills wise so if you read the book you will see all of what I'm saying and more and uh, yeah so if you would like to um, like I said for this series all four books just really remind me of a action packed movie you know like a, a Mission Impossible or a, you know something in that 007 type of situations. I mean, you just, you have to read them and get into them to see it. If you like the type of movies, you should like all four of these books because they're phenomenal. So, get into it. Again, book number three is Truth or Consequences. And it's by Sharon C. Cooper. So, I hope you get into it, enjoy it. And um, if you have read any of them so far, 
I would really love if you leave a comment down there. Let me know how you feel about any of them. If you liked my suggestions to any of the books I've ever reviewed on my channel or whatever um, you feel. Just let me know if you like any of the books I have suggested on my um, channel. If you are a regular um, viewer of my book reviews. And if you are a reader and have actually read some of the books. So, let me know. I would really love to know that in the comments. Seriously. So, if you made it to the end of my video, thank you so much. And please do not forget to subscribe, like, hit that notification bell so you can be made aware every time I upload a video. And thank you so much for doing so. Enjoy the rest of your evening. I swear.